Today's video, um, I figured I'd go ahead. I know the last video I put out, I said that I had uh, an update on my ground garden area. Um, for me, it's like an exciting thing. We're not going to plant a huge garden, so we don't really need a tractor. But for the garden area that we're going to do, when you don't have um, the right kind of equipment that makes the job easier, it makes the job longer to complete. And I haven't run one of these in quite a long time, but from my memory, um, let me go ahead and I'll show you it. Having a tiller is a whole lot better than breaking the ground up with a shovel, a hoe, a spade, a pitchfork, whatever. This makes it quicker and easier. It does beat your upper body up pretty good. And we were actually um, blessed with this one and we were in need of it. If I can get it running, this is what I'm going to use. Um, I've already taken it apart. It's been sitting for quite a few years in the carburetor, which is off right now, it's rebuilt. And I'm not a small engine repair person. I had somebody come up and check it out with me. And they had to take it and re rebuild the carburetor, which is done now. So I didn't video that part, but um, I'm going to put it back together, put new oil in it, put a little bit of fuel in it, and see if maybe I can get it to run. Um, I had it where it would fire, but it wouldn't stay running, <clears throat> so that's why I thought maybe it was the carburetor um, and uh, had that checked out but uh, anyhow um, it's incredible what what uh, what what some people will do to help out um, make your life easier when they find that you actually have a need and they have something they don't necessarily need. Um, so anyhow, <clears throat> with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna put this thing back together. Sometime this week, I'm gonna be out there. I think, I don't know if tomorrow, depending on how heavy the rain is this evening, this afternoon, will depend on whether I can, I can actually get the ground garden, um, get it tilled up a little better um, tomorrow or not. But I want to get it done this week because I've got a lot of stuff I want to get planted. And I want to get it planted sooner than later. Um, now that the weather I think is going to stay warm above 40 into the 50s, um, uh, you know, with it being this late in April, I don't, I don't necessarily think we're going to have cold weather again, hopefully. Um, but anyhow, with that, um, I'm just rambling. So let me go ahead, I'll set the camera up and... Uh, you can see if I can get this thing started.
it is leaking fluid fuel right here. Um, I have to get a better uh, clamp to seal that area up. But let's see. All I got to do now is put a better clamp on this hose. So I don't think I can get this one to clamp right. I've not filled the, the gas tank on this with fuel because I didn't want to take a chance of having to dump the fuel out again if, I, if it didn't work. So there's not that much fuel in there. It should stop dripping here in a minute. Okay, so after a drive into town to pick up these, make sure I got the right size, time to work on the uh, tiller again. I'm wearing these gloves because fuel smell, it's hard to get off your hands. So I'd rather not smell like a gas can all day, got a lot to do. That's about as close as I can get it without being a little bit in the way. Hopefully, we go ahead and be prepared for fuel to come out. Let's see what happens. If it does, it's not the end of the world. It's gonna. You would think that it wouldn't leak so much if it was that tight on there. So kind of the smallest one I could get. I'm sure there's probably smaller clamps. But I honestly think this one will work. I just couldn't find one at the hardware store where I was at. All right, here we go. I think maybe, maybe that'll work. All right, so let's go ahead. I want to see if that'll stop it from leaking. I'm going to do a couple more turns. I just don't want to get too tight and wind up doing damage to the hose. All right, here we go. Hopefully it fires up just the way it did the other day. And there'll be no leak. <laughs> 